Hey everybody, it's Aaron with Weekends with the Camper. So, I have, and it came with the camper, it's a Suburban Elite Griddle, Elite Series Griddle. And it came with the camper, it came with the outdoor kitchen on our camper. And I honestly think it's not worth the money to buy anything that got the Elite Series Griddle. I have had it running for the last, I'm going to say a good 15 minutes. Um, I'm reseasoning it because uh, I tried it last year and thinking maybe it was just a bad idea or, or bad gas or low on gas or something, but I got two fresh tanks and we got everything running. It's warm, but it's not hot. And since I reseasoned it, I'm trying to get it to burn off all this top off. Like I said, it's been running for 15 minutes now. And it just does not get hot enough. Um, I'm on, on high. I've checked all my connections. Um, see the gas in there in the flame but it's just there's an h-shaped burn bar inside there and I think you're lucky if you got a quarter inch flame there I it just does not get hot enough now I've been trying to cook bacon this morning and like I said 15 20 minutes is still trying to warm up now my grill, on the other hand, is already at 200 degrees, and I started that before this two before the two minutes started on this video. I'm at 210 now, so that's heating up great. That's what I'm going to cook my bacon on. But if you run across those suburban elite griddles, walk away from them. Go get a Blackstone. Um, everybody that I've seen that has them absolutely loves them. Um, I'm not sponsored by Blackstone. I'm not sponsored by anybody. I have no sponsors. But you come across those sun suburban elites, walk away from them. They just don't get hot enough. They heat out uneven. And I mean, I can't even I can't even season it. It won't get hot enough to even season it. Um, I shouldn't have to wait 20 minutes for a grill or preheat. Um, but that's my review on that. Uh, have a good day. Happy 4th of July since I just got over with. And I hope you like and follow and share. Thank you.